All right, guys, we're about to bring up everyone's favorite ranger. I don't want peace. I want problems, always. <laughs> and Brent fam, let's go. Hi. How are you, Brent? Uh, I know you're Good super man. duper happy. Are you are you ready to for your tape to finally come out? Now, don't give it away because I know you already seen it. But are you? Did ready? you see the whole thing? I have watched the whole entire thing. Whole entire yes. thing. I, okay. 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 <laughs> the Brit, the Brit I have to keep the suspense. You know, this is entertain. This is uh, partial entertainment. So you have to keep people no. suspense. Well, get them, get them, get them pumped up. Here's you know. The thing. You were so happy to meet David Yost. You were like, it was. What the hell is this? You were doing this like all the time. Because um, you notice how he had. As you could see, there was a lot of autographs and he um, and a lot of pictures on the table. So instead of putting my hands on the table to ruin the pictures, I had to uh, wipe the whatever sweat I had on my hands so it wouldn't get on the, the table. Does uh, that make sense? OK, so he was keeping the hands dry, guys. I'm telling you, in the when you see this video, I have to chop it up It's three parts. Now, I think you got what I would describe as a solid interview from him, even though it was probably less than like a five minute interaction, you hit mm -hmm. some, you hit some really good targets. He talked about Austin St. John. Mm -hmm. uh, he talked about leaving the show, talked about um, Twee, talked about JDF, asked some, some good questions. How do you think the interview went overall? I thought it was great, and um, people are going to say, you you kept people waiting. Henry, you saw, um, I don't want to give too much. Uh, I didn't keep anybody waiting. He, he, he appreciate. he told me literally at the end, he appreciates me. Oh, yeah. At, yeah. After all the, after I asked him that question about the walkout, the one that he was annoyed about, and the one he turned, and he turns the camera. He turns the camera, and he, I didn't even notice because I was too nervous and excited. And um, and he said at the end he appreciates me, and he showed his appreciation by calling security on me, asshole. Excuse my language. Um, he, let me just say this: what he did, he, what Hector David Jr. did, is much worse. But um, David is more prominent in the con scene. Hector is not as prominent. David is a bigger name, so I think um, if you compare the two situations i think whatever i say when the video is released might have a slightly more impact simply because david Yost is a much bigger name now what hector david jr did was absolutely hor horrible what a piece of shit what hector did and he's and he hasn't even apologized has he said anything did he say that he's sorry no i mean i know that sounds very juvenile like did he say he's sorry but it's kind of like if you want people to, he's not sorry, um, man. He doesn't care. No, he he doesn't care. This is this is who this is who he's this is who he is. This is who he always be. Maybe after he go to jail, people will someone to knock some sense into him. But chances are they won't. Chances are they yeah. won't. It's the same he's guy, uh, you know, putting hands on his baby mama. Same guy tackling a woman at a goddamn bus stop. Uh, it's worse. I'm wondering if Akan is going to have him, but who who gives a who cares about this guy who who will be out of the scene within six months? Everyone right. wants to know about David Yost. And guys, when I when I watched the tape, it took me like a little bit to watch it. it I'm not going to say everything Brent said was true per se, but you guys can see the interview for yourself, and we will have the Brent. David Yo stream on Friday, and Friday, okay. Um, like, let me see. I don't. I don't even think I can give y'all a preview of it because it's so, uh, it's so choppy. Um, let me see. So, what I, did I not tell the truth about, Henry? Did I? Are you saying that I didn't tell the truth? I wouldn't say you didn't tell the truth, but hold on. Let me let me see if we can pull up a little, really? a snippet of the tape. A snippet, okay. Uh, I gotta I gotta protect everyone's email. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta protect some emails out here. All right, All right not yeah. exposed. Okay, okay, okay. All right. Um, 
So guys, here is what it looks like, per se. It's like this. <laughs> like, you can see, uh, this is him signing. This is early on. This is not the juicy part. The juicy part comes far later. Um, I know. This is like some of the recovered footage and what it's going to look like Wednesday. Uh, I know um, Sarah would want to try. Um, Sarah look brent was so happy he dropped remember he was like oh i gave him some extra money because i was telling them what to sign and he was just taking it like a champ so david yost i know you watching everything's about to come out money went there for lunch and said it was amazing Monty went there for lunch and said it was amazing. Yeah, like as you see, like it, it repeats. So what I'm gonna have to do is gonna have to chop it up. <laughs> I'm going to right, right, because um, this video was extremely hard to get. Like, I, I hired a specialist. I sent you the information, Henry. People don't believe me. I went to a specialist, and he used every device in his office, and he not one device worked. So we had to, he had to uh, get a referral in, to someone in Europe, in Germany, to do this, and it took him two weeks. And um, we asked the same guy to do to clean it up to make it clean. And he said, are you are you serious? You know how hard it was to get this footage? It'll cost you $700. I was like, oh, screw that shit. I'll just have a degenerate edit it. Like, I, I'm, I'm done. There's no way I'm, I'm spending that money. No, I can clean it up. Yeah, you can clean it up. You guys see it. It's it's one hundred percent coming. It's one hundred percent here. Brent uh -huh. will finally have his moment to air out David Yost for calling security on it. There was one part missing, but I'll save it for tomorrow or Wednesday when we when we talk about it. I was like, mm. but uh, what do you guys think? Are y'all ready? Do y'all believe Brent? The all right. Here we go. Put a one in the chat if you believe him. Put a two if you think he's lying. And we do believe have, what? What? What do you mean? Uh, the story. Your do. Do you think? Do you think Brent left out some context? If you Henry, remember, <laughs> I I told you, it once you agree to release to the video, you agree that the context is there, and if there's anything missing, I gave you the phone number of the person who found the video. Well, so, and like he will explain to you why you. there is a, a repeat. Oh no! It's I, because Brent, you're tripping, man. Don't worry yeah. about. Don't worry about that. The repeat, right, right. everything is going to get finalized. Mm -hmm. But do you believe Brent, guys? Yes or no? Just put why or no, not one or two. Yes or no? Do you believe Brent about everything? Do you think he was honest? Do you think he was forthcoming? And Brent, you shouldn't even care if I think you left out context or not, man. That should be like when you do this internet thing, don't care what other people think. Don't fall into the Rican stuff. Um, well, I mean, <laughs> Nick, Nick, Nick said he don't believe you for shit. Nick. Nick been not liking you for over a year. <laughs> what does he not believe? I mean, I don't know, man. You got to talk to Nick, man. You got to talk to Nick. Okay. <laughs> right. Uh, but yeah, we got David jo Yost in the chat. Brent, give the phone number of the person who cares. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know if that's the real David Yost. It look, it has his picture. It has his name, but I don't think that's the real David Yost, man. But what right, right. what do you hope people gain from this tape when it comes out? I'm not trying to cancel him because I said this multiple times, but people conveniently forget that I've said this. Um, you can't cancel someone. Um, P. Diddy, if he had a concert in Madison Square Garden, I am convinced people would show up. 100%. And now, would there be protests? Absolutely. But people would show up. So if P. Diddy could do that, then what is, how am I going to cancel David Yost? There's just, no, it's not realistic. It's not happening. But the reason why I'm, I spent the money to recover the video is because people go to these cons and they support David because of his message of being against the bully, um, of standing up, leaving the show because 
um, the producers or whoever was bullying him on the show and people, they re that message resonates. What you do, not just on the show, but off the show matters. Uh, people take those things into account. And um, the mere fact that he called security when he had ample opportunity to ask me in person nicely if I could delete the footage um, shows to me that he did not, he wanted security to do whatever they could to delete the video. Because if, if he was willing to be quote unquote okay with me with leaving the footage, he would have asked me in person. Yeah. And he had so many opportunities to do so. And there was even a moment in the video, there was like a, a minute pause of where we don't, we don't talk about anything where we were just standing there. He, he was sitting there not saying anything. And I was packing up my things. He could have said to me, Brent, please I delete that footage. Um, I turned, I turned the camera away because I said something. I, uh, I, I talked about something I didn't feel comfortable talking about. Can you please delete the video? I'll give you a refund. I would have done it, but he didn't want to do that. Instead, um, instead of, asking me nicely he used security and why think people need to think about why would he call security as that's and skip the step of asking me in person when as you could see in the video the conversation was a great conversation it was very cordial it was a good I, conversation. it was flowing well guys it was smooth it, it was there you know um they talked right. about a multitude of things but it's all gonna come out wednesday brent finally uh, got friday wednesday Oh, for, okay. Wednesday. Okay. Wednesday. Wednesday is the day. All right. Are you ready? And, uh, Are you nervous? What if David Yost calls into the stream? He's in a, yeah, right. I, that'd be hard to believe. Um, he's Gosh. a coward. I emailed him and he didn't respond. Um, I emailed his agent, didn't respond and he blocked us. And I, when you see the footage, the video footage that's deleted, you'll know why he, he, he blocked us instead of saying this Brent fam guy, he's slandering my name. Um, I will take little action. He notice how he didn't say that. Instead, he said, "Block uh, dust or whatever." <laughs> I'm gonna have to block you. I'm I'm gonna have to I block have to you. Block, block done. Uh, probably do because he knows that um, he was a coward. But you know, he, people will see for themselves. And if they want to support David, I'm not gonna say that's not the right thing to do. You make a decision for yourself. But people are gonna see this and say this guy was a fan. He liked your work. He, he wasn't there to quote unquote harass you. Har harass him, I should say. Um, Henry, you saw the video. It was a it was a great conversation. I I, I, I enjoyed guys, it. it I was can a say I, I did. It was a good conversation. You guys are gonna see it Wednesday when I cl clip it all up. But John C says, David Yos, send Brent a refund. I know you ninja watching. <laughs> I might have to block you, block and you. and I'm not uh, doing it for the do. money because it is obvious that I spent more you spent than six way, you spent the guys. He spent a <laughs> lot of money on this video. And How do you so, know? Did you call the guy? I did not call the guy, but I can just see the level of difficulty to um re <sighs> recover such a recording takes a lot of effort. Okay, yes. just in the way it was re it was recovered, I'm like, damn. But what I do, what I can promise you guys is crystal clear audio and some crystal clear footage of David Yale's responses, which was what I, which is what I wanted to have um, the most is the crystal clear responses of David Yost, which I would say he captured about 90% of them. Some is, right. like, uh, is a little off, but you'll, you'll get to see everything from, you know, how the interaction went to Brent literally walking away, going up some elevators, and then he walks into a bathroom, and then I had to I had to stop watching. Whoa. <laughs> All right, there's no bathroom. <laughs> you, yeah, that's made up. But, you, <laughs> but, but, and I know, Henry, you're looking for the juice of the walkout, and people can have their own opinions. Like, David Yost said a certain thing. That's a fact. And people could decide for themselves if they want to believe David. You know, he's, David Yost was cooking. He didn't, I don't think David Yost knew he was cooking. And once he realized what he said, he probably had some remorse in knowing that right. that was going to get out. And now he, no, 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 but, but he knew beforehand that he, that before yeah. I asked the question, before he answered, he knew um, that he didn't want it recorded. He knew that. And that's a fact. Because look, you'll see in the video, I didn't force a camera on him. People are going to say, you forced a camera. It, uh, it was no secret recording, guys. This shit was like in his face. Yeah, um, it was. It was yeah. on the table. Everyone was recording. You could see like some people probably was like, God damn, David Yoshi, you giving up a lot of juice. 
And maybe after you left, he had like some remorse, like, oh man, I probably shouldn't have said that. Okay, we need to get that, keep that footage from coming out. And it's and unfortunate I, that he went through all this effort to delete the footage only for the footage to come out anyway. That's the, that's the FU David Yost right there. And I did that because let me just say this. If he would have been nice, like Amy Joe, I, I wouldn't release. If he would have asked me, I would have deleted the footage or not released it, but I need a proof to like people. Can, if, if people want to believe David about the strike, I personally don't believe it because um, the, the, the lengths that he went to have that footage deleted, you need to stand on business. If it's the truth, it's, if it's the truth, to stand on business. Um, that's my opinion. But you can believe whatever you want. The issue is what he did to a fan who who was clearly was a fan of his. Um, what he did to me is just outrageous. And I'm speaking to those people. It doesn't matter um, if David ordered them to surround me. The mere notion that he called security when he didn't even ask me one time to delete it himself. It's implied that he did not. He did not want me to leave. He did not want me to leave that convention hall with the footage. And it's uh, just implied. Guess what, guys? He didn't bring up my name either. <laughs> like he said, he didn't. My name never came up. So right. There's that. So. But all right, guys. That was Brent Fam. Thank you, Brent. We will right, have you. you uh wednesday tune in for the uh brent stream all right Peace. brent stream okay fair, fair.